Hey what's up I'm Nizio Cole and it has been 3 years since the initial release of Watch Dogs Legion on October 29th 2020. For the past 3 years I have done a kind of a recap video of everything that's happened with Watch Dogs Legion in the past year. And over the past 3 years the amount that I have had to talk about in those videos has decreased. And that means this will probably be the last one. I'm not the first person to talk about it, but I wanted to wait until the third anniversary of Legion to kind of see if there's anything that we'd see from Ubisoft or they'd announce anything else, but it doesn't look like that's going to be the case. So yeah, in the previous two videos, I had a little bit more to talk about, but there was um, pretty much nothing from Ubisoft over the past year. The only thing that's really happened in regards to Watch Dogs Legion is the fact that they released it on Steam, and it was sort of a thing that you could tell that they didn't really put too much thought or care into. And besides that, we've pretty much gotten radio silence from Ubisoft in the past year. And it's really unfortunate, because it doesn't look like Ubisoft really wants to continue with Watch Dogs at all. And Ubisoft isn't the only one that we've gotten radio silence from in the past year, Nomad Group. If you don't know, Nomad Group created the Watch Dogs 2 and Watch Dogs Legion script hook, and they were also developing a multiplayer add-on for Watch Dogs Legion called Watch Dogs Legion United, but that all ended on November 8th, 2022. They released a development update on the status of Watch Dogs Legion that reads, It's been a while since our last blog post and we wanted to provide an update on the current state of Watch Dogs Legion United and Nomad Group. As you know, our target release window for the next major version of Watch Dogs Legion United was planned for September. However, as we experienced several changes along the way that ultimately prevented us from spending as much time on our projects as we have in the past, we have made the difficult decision to cease development on Watch Dogs Legion United. After much consideration regarding the time spent working on this project and the dedication of every team member involved, this decision was not made lightly. We can only thank everyone who joined us on that journey, helping us testing United, shared feedback and ideas for building multiplayer modification platform for Watch Dogs Legion. Signed, Nomad Group. And since this was released, there has been absolutely no news whatsoever from any developers from that group. I didn't make a video on this right after because as with Ubisoft, I wanted to kind of give it some time to breathe and see if there would be any updates in the future, and so far, there have been none. This isn't the only issue to come from Ubisoft and Nomad Group abandoning the game, however, because even though Nomad Group has decided to stop working on this, you still should be able to use the Watch Dogs Legion script hook, which you can as long as you didn't buy the game on Steam. See, a little side effect of Ubisoft and Nomad Group working together is that there is some sort of DRM implemented in the script hook that basically disallows the script hook from being installed on pirated versions of the game, which is all well and good, except for the fact that it just won't work on Steam versions of the game. If someone were to try to install the script hook on the Steam version of the game, they would receive an unrecognized game version and not be able to play with the script hook. This was not communicated by Ubisoft or Nomad Group, and I reached out to them earlier this year after the Steam version was released and have yet to receive a response. So that's all I really had to talk about as far as Watch Dogs Legion. Like I said, this will probably be my last yearly update video on Watch Dogs Legion. But just talking more broadly as far as the channel goes, I won't stop making Watch Dogs videos until I've actually run out of video ideas and or mods to talk about, which will probably be for quite a while. But in the meantime, I will be switching it up a little bit. I'm going to be making videos on different games, kind of mixed in with the Watch Dogs videos. So let me know down in the comment section below what games you want to see me cover on the channel, what topics, what types of videos. I'm really open to anything except for MOBAs. One other announcement I wanted to make is that I have made a Discord server for the channel, which I will have linked in the description, just to kind of create more of a conversation with the audience. I have different channels for Watch Dogs and other games, and if you have any video ideas, of course you can put it in there. But yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this video, and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.